What is going on, Pezzos? My name is JB, and welcome back to my ICBA late season recap, I guess you could call this. Uh, we are taking on uh, Splurge in this replay for week 10, and um, yeah, that is that. Week 8, I played Johnny GB, but he uh, dropped, and I ended up playing Austin, got a 2-0 win there. He took over that team, and then we played CJ Beastly. Week 9, I don't remember the score, but I know I took that fat L in that game so here we are in week 10 basically um i am f uh five and four at this point with a negative three differential and i can still i am very much alive in playoffs i was nine seed going into this game but uh, basically if i win 4-0 or better i'm pretty much 100 percent secure uh if i just win and get six and four it depends on other people's differentials whether or not i make it so basically big win and we're in uh other things and it depends on other people lost and we're out basically so yeah we're playing splurge uh coach of the bracknell beedrills you can see he ended up bringing a sneasel a uh, chandelure top of bulu halucha run frost and sell us steal us so uh the team we have i i lost all my teams on showdown so i don't actually like have the specifics of this team i don't think do i uh, no, I do not. So unfortunately, I do not do not have like the specifics of this team. But I know we are um, agility three attacks, Mega Metagross. We are Metronome, Sub, Leaf Storm, Giga Drain, HP Fire, uh, Superior. Superior. The idea being, once uh, his grass resist goes down, mainly the uh, in this case the Chandelure or the Celesteela, uh, Giga Drain is incredibly free to like two hit KO everything with Metronome boost. Uh, pr probably just Scarf, Primeape, if I had to guess. Uh, probably like AV or... Yeah, I think we were AV. Um, Drapion as a way to sort of live hits from Chandelure. Uh, definitely AV Eel because that's the only set. And I think we were like Spadef. Um, or Fizz... Probably Fizzduff. Uh, Togu Kiss looking at this with like uh, Thunder Wave and stuff like that. So let's go ahead and get straight into the game. I decided to lead off with my Eel. As he ends up leading off with the Celesteel, I'm like, alright, I really want to Acid Spray here on the potential um, Bulu coming in. But I decided to just go for T-Bolt, and you can see it does a ton as he just goes for Elite Seed. And we actually managed to snag a para full Para, or just a full Para, para whatever. We, we, we paralyzed the damn thing, shut up! Uh, but I can just drop another T-Bolt, like, I'm like, alright, cool, I can just give her the Celesteel. Or if he wants to go Bulu, I can, you know, uh, either go hard Togekiss like I do afterwards, or I can... Um, you know, ass is right after. I can decide what I want to do. Basically, I can T-Bolt and then, you know, just go from there. But he goes Bulu. I decided to bring in Togekiss. He goes for a Horn Leech. You can see that does. Still a decent amount. So, like, a Fizz Death Togekiss. But, you know, it's not insignificant damage. I could just go hard into Metagross here. As he goes for a Stone Edge. So, he make a little bit of a cool play. I was like, I, I could take Horn Leech and that's fine. So, he uh, he just goes right into the Celesteela. As I decided to go for Meteor Mash. You know, wanting to get a boost or, you know, trying to... Uh, kill the Bulu, uh, but I can just go for agility against Celesteela. I don't really care what it wants to do. If he wants to leech at me, whatever. He wants to fire blast me. You can see it only does like half. We are pretty bulky. Set and uh, something worth noting. I do know at some point I am going to have to um, agility again if I want to be able to outspeed out Holucha in the terrain. So I know at some point I'm going to have to do it again, but I decided to just go for a Thunder Punch on the uh, Celesteela. Obviously, just pick that thing off. He's going to go into Bulu now. And uh, I'm going to agility up first on this because I know it can eat any one hit. We know he's not choice banded, so I don't have to worry about uh, dying to like a choice banded wood hammer. Uh, if he went for like throat chop or something, I guess that could have been bad, but uh, <laughs> it is what it is. I decided to go for a uh, agility first. As you can see, he's going to drop a fat horn leech. And does like 26%. I can take that very well, get that aggressive uh, train recovery, and then I can just go for meteor mash. And uh, straight up Oko the Bulu, get an attack boost, which is... Just hella nice, and we do outspeed the Halucha at this point, because I did get the second agility up. I can go for Zen Headbutt. That thing's going to drop even with the defense boost, and you can see where this is going. Uh, he goes into the uh, Run Frost. That thing drops to a Meteor Mash. Uh, thankfully, we're hitting all of our moves, so that's really cool. Not having to miss. Uh, he goes into uh, Weaver, or Sneasel, gets a crit Ice Shard. Does absolutely nothing, because Mega Metagross. Uh, hit another Meteor Mash. That thing goes down, and he can go into, last but not least, the... Uh, Chandelure and drop to the last and finals in headbutt. So Mega Metagross coming in clutch, picking up a huge 6-0 for us, which is just phenomenal. So uh, we're going to be going into the playoffs with a 6-4 plus 3 differential overall in the season. Uh, overall, you know, not a, not as great as I would, uh, you know, wanted to finish the season, you know, record and differential-wise. But, you know, playoffs is playoffs and we take those, so 
That's all that really matters. You do split, of course, so be sure to go check him out, as well as all the other coaches in the description down below. And, you know, I just want to apologize for lack of ICBA and just uploads in general. I've kind of just gotten lazy. I got super swamped with, like, the games just felt like they were all piling on top of each other at the same time because, like, so many things were delayed and it just, like... I, I think I legitimately played like six or seven league games in like a four day span and it was exhausting so I just I never got around to uploading or anything like that so that's just my bad. Um, so yeah with that being said we are going to be taking on Melintosh, Melintosh in the uh, first round. So it should be a fun time so hopefully we can come out of that game with a dub. Should be fun times I don't know why I keep saying fun but yeah you know shout out to that. Anyway, uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you all in playoffs. Peace!